Hey internet, what Reddit says here, welcome to Cursed Comments Volume 9. How did we get to Volume 9 already? This is where we make a compilation of what the hell did I just read? Not for the faint of heart. Keep it cursed! So first up we have a Reddit post. Males of Reddit, when was the absolute worst time you had a random boner? Holding a weeping woman who I was coming to realise I was in love with during a funeral wake. I moved her to my side, but I think she knew. Morning wood. <laughs> That's a great pun. Those are elementary examples. My sister walked into the bathroom and pointed out mine in the shower while I was washing my hair. What are you doing, big bro? Oh my god, do you have a boner? I'm going to tell mom. Like, what are you going to tell mom? That you saw your brother's penis in the shower? Jeez. What if your teeth were naturally flaccid and got hard when you got hungry? But mom, I'm not hungry. Honey, I see you're hard, just eat it. What the fuck? So what happens if my teeth stay hard for more than four hours? Consult your dentist. Your dentist will relax you down. What the fuck? It won't be the dentist, it'll be the oral surgeon. Mm. My girlfriend works in a sushi restaurant. She's pretty. We know how this ends. Oh, do we? I'm not sure I wanna know. Come squid. Oh, there we go. She looks like she gives a mean circumcision. <laughs> oh, slash cursed, cursed comments. Hi guys, I was cooking last night, making some chicken breasts. I had spilled some soda on my pants, so I was cooking without pants on. I was moving some trays around and I accidentally dropped a chicken breast on the floor, but it hit my penis before it hit the floor. This morning my penis seems like it's inflamed and the pee hole hurts if I touch it. Is it possible I got salmonella poisoning? Hmm, here we go. You fucked those chicken breasts, didn't you? You fucked the raw chicken, didn't you? You did. Oh, he absolutely did. You should have made it into a pie first, you know, American pie style. There is no penis salmonella. It's not a skin infection. It's probably because one of the other countless bacteria you find on uncooked meat. But he certainly did fuck it. He did. He really did. He done diddly did it. That's right, he done diddly did do it. I, 21 male, have a micro penis. Ask me anything. I'm pretty depressed about it. Ask me anything. Maybe there's a girl out there with a micro vagina. There technically is, but that's illegal. Oh. <sighs> why, why does this always come down to pedo talk, huh? What's wrong with you guys? In Norway, we have a blogger who a couple of years ago made a post with a request for a man with a small enough penis to fuck her in the ear, just saying. Jesus, what's wrong with Norway? This is how you end up with hearing AIDS. <laughs> Good one. She's fine and legless. Fellas, stop thinking what you're thinking. Woman born with no legs makes a living as a lingerie model. She invited me to a party once with all their amputee girlfriends. The place was crawling with pussy. <laughs> That's just wrong. <laughs> She'd never walk out on you. <laughs> True. This deserves a standing ovation. That pun stands out among the rest. Outstanding. You people are sick. You wouldn't be making these jokes if you walked a mile in her shoes. <laughs> I'm the fastest YouTuber and I'm willing to put $100,000 on it. Wait, fastest at what? Filming dead bodies. Oh, yikes. True story though. The fastest YouTuber to become hated. That's yeah, also a true story. James Charles screams in cursive. What do you think sex was like in the 1940s and 1950s? Finish quick, I can hear the air raid sirens. <laughs> the bombers weren't the only things coming faster than expected. It takes longer to find out if his payload missed the target. We've got to drop the load. The children, they're all dead. My sister-in-law died in a fire. Her Bible was by beside her bed on a stand. Not a burn mark on the Bible. Awesome. Miracle from God. Imagine killing someone's sister-in-law and then leaving your business card. Strongest possible flex. Sister-in-law died in fire. The Bible beside her not. Awesome miracle from God. It's obviously sarcasm, guys. If you'd met my sister-in-law, you'd be praising God too. Oh, maybe not. Oh, burn. Oh, she did. Huh. Damn, guys. That's, that's, uh, that's a bit harsh, isn't it? Me. Hey Pixar, are you a boobs guy or a butt guy? P 
Pixar showing scantily clad female characters with huge butts. You know, I never realised that Pixar so uh, sexual. Look at it. Look at the size of these butts. Jesus. Bitch on the left has no ribs or organs, just a skull, spine and then ass. Just the way the mouse likes it. For reference, Disney is known for the mouse, which is Di which is Mickey and Minnie. So that's why it's uh, that's why Disney likes it, I suppose. Bo Peep is one thick big, big. What the hell's big? Dummy thick. Nah, Elastigirl is the dummy thick one. She could be using her stretchy powers though. What if her original form is a fat blob? Hmm. Cursed Thor using a red laser pen. And that cat just above her um, her area, let's see. So this is how girls get those little furry tails at Comic-Con. Imagine the shit the boyfriend is getting now that his girl's ass is all over the internet. Plot twist, her brother took the pic. Same thing. Oh, where's the Alabama comments? Bring girlfriend, 5% off. Bring wife, 10% off. Bring both, free meal. Stonks. Great, now I can bring in my daughter and my wife for a free meal. Jesus. I bet he's not even joking. Aren't his wife and his daughter the same people? No, his daughter is his girlfriend. After she gets to 14, then he can divorce his wife and marry his girlfriend and the cycle continues. What? Historically, your first wife is your sister to get the ball rolling on this process. When it goes cousin, sister and then daughter. Cousin is a little too unrelated, but I guess that's how it goes these days. Every day we stray further from Alabama. Oh, there's the Alabama comment. <laughs> what if this happened? Ariana Grande and Fortnite. Explosive steal extra damage. No, guys, that's that's just wrong. That's just wrong. That's not even a cursed comment. That's just... No, you're not allowed. Stop it, internet. User Peter explains the joke. I'm lost. There was a bombing at her concert. Oh, I forgot about that. Thank you. Next. Thank you. Next. Are you serious? Thank you. Next. You guys, you guys are insane. At what point did you realize you weren't a child anymore? My priest wasn't interested in, in me anymore. Holy cow. Guys, come on. Jesus. True story though. When my hands got too big for the Pringles can opening. Oh, there's a good answer. Unfortunately, the priest's hands will never be too big for your opening. Oh, there we go. Back into... <sighs> I don't know what. The priest has always welcomed my opening. Oh, my God. That's it. That's... I can't... I can't do it anymore. This is... Just... <laughs> just read something about replacing I'm sorry with thank you. So instead of saying sorry I was late, say thank you for waiting for me. Replacing negativity with positivity and gratitude and breaks the I'm sorry cycle. Powerful. Thank you for letting me sleep with your sister. Yeah, I don't think the uh, the op really thought about this, did they? Yeah, here we go to the comments. I appreciate <laughs> I appreciate you giving me the opportunity to dip my penis into your grandmother's ashes. Yeah, this is this is going just as I expected. That's enough Reddit for today. Yeah, I agree with that guy. Ha ha ha. R slash curse comments. Indeed, indeed. Make her pussy wet, not her eyes. Make his dick hard, not his life. Break her bed, not her heart. Play with her boobs, not her feelings. Fuck her, not her child. Jesus. Gee, why do we have to always end up like this kind of stuff, huh? Loop her, then Uber. <laughs> Come and go. Ejaculate and evacuate. Bugger her, then bugger off. Breed and proceed. There you have it, guys, out there. That's how you remain single the rest of your life. So I've been coming in my roommate's girlfriend's body wash because they're annoying as fuck. Oh, here we go. For like two months, jerk it, jerk it in the shower, open the pump, dump it in and give it a good shake. He just told me her period was super late so they took a pregnancy test and she's knocked up. He said I trust her, I guess a condom ripped or I don't know. And they're going to raise it, we have a year on the lease. Problem is, I'm Greek and they're white as fuck. What are the chances I'm a dad? <laughs> What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> she had to stick the body wash up there in order to get pregnant. Maybe she used the body wash as lube when she got frisky with herself in the shower and then she got pregnant from the soap. Or she's cheating on her boyfriend with another guy. Probably the latter to be, to be honest.
A man dropped a bo <laughs> A man dropped a box of dicks on a road. It started with a traffic jam. I guess it was a cock block. <laughs> Five second rule, you can still eat them. Five second rule applies for everything. Like the time I pushed my grandma down the stairs, I still ate her out. Fuck, what the fuck? Jeez, definitely some bleach in my eyes after after this video. R slash curse, curse comments. You're right about that, mate. Gorillas, kids with guns, official video, music video. All rise for the American national anthem. <laughs> oh, guys, honestly, killing me. Absolute banger. We don't call 911. Yeah, when my mum fell down the stairs and broke her hip, we just shot her. Only way I can afford healthcare. Is it worth it though? What about your lawyer fees? I don't handle that either. I just keep shooting until I become a dictator. OJ Simpson says, Please stop calling me OJ Simpson. What are you gonna do? Kill my wife? Oof. Oof, guys. Damn, he threw down the glove. And OJ Simpson's gonna throw down his wife. <laughs> Jesus. Really cut into the bone core of this pun thread quickly. You are the last person on earth, what do you do? Is everyone dead and lying around, or does everyone just disappear? Disappear, does it make a difference? No bodies to fuck. Oh, of course, of course. I mean, despite the necrophilia aspect, if all dead bodies would still be laying around earth, would be smelling like shit in a couple of days. Better eat all the bodies before they go bad then. I was thinking about that too, better conserve it for later. Cause at the moment, there's still plenty normal food ready to get eaten. And under no circumstance should you ever hit a woman making out. Spank me, Kenny. No. I'm proud of you, son. Now that she's not a woman, you can spank him. What the fuck, dad? We did it, boys. Feminism is no more. I'd spank the fuck out of my dad. He deserves it for teaching me such a good lesson. Thanks, daddy. Doesn't that mean he was making out with his dad the whole time? It does indeed. It does indeed. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, wait. I mean, there's nothing wrong with a man kissing another man, not... A um, boy kissing his father. Yeah, okay. Right. How do you poop in the shower? A. Anus facing the drain. Poop. <laughs> and then squash it down the drain. <laughs> or like this. B. Uh, stroke your bum. Pull it out. And then throw it into the toilet. Okay. Alright. Nice. I do, <laughs> I do part one of A. And then reverse part of one of B. I just thrust my ass backwards as hard as I can while it's coming out and aim for the toilet. <laughs> Does your ass have a jet propulsion? Holy fuck. Yours doesn't? It takes a lot of hard work and training. Not everyone has the skill or determination to do it. Alright guys, seriously. Th Does anyone actually poop in the shower? Like, serious, I, I want some comments on this one. Does anyone actually do that? If so, why? Why, why do it in the shower? Other people got to use that shower. I mean, masturbation's fine, but... You know, pooping, that's a, that's a whole different ball game. I hope my mum doesn't watch this vid. Alright guys, that's it for this video. Let me know what your funniest or worst cursed comments were. Or any other comments about the video that you liked or disliked. That would be, that'd be really great. Don't forget to uh, please subscribe, like, and leave a comment, share. Share with your family. Yeah, it's a family video. Alright, thanks, bye.